Yeah, yeah, I'm different. Nah, I don't fit the system. What is going on everybody? Welcome back to episode 2 because we started a new series because the second series was a little bit difficult to record for me and keeping up with it was a little bit over the top. However, we're back into it. We've got 15 minutes on the clock of however long and we're just currently chopping wood because there is a little secret. If you don't know about it, then be happy to follow along. But we're going to the beach in this episode. Well, I have... I hope that in 15 minutes we can get enough wood to go to the beach and repair this. But we're going to go over to the beach and we're going to take some of the clams and other things, coral and stuff that are over there. Because this isn't my first playthrough anymore. I was doing that while I was doing a little bit of um, vlog. Well, yeah, vlog gaming, vlogging and gaming. Which, this is sort of vlogging and gaming. I prefer to talk while I'm doing something rather than re-record it because it's a lot of a hassle to try and fit everything to perfect times and sort of talk over things um, and also rewrite scripts etc but I think we should have enough now so if I put some more things in this chest so I'll just put all the things that I don't think I need and I'll just take the wood we can set off towards the what do we need to... Oh, we should have kept one parsnip, damn it. Um, but we're going to go over towards the beach now. Because we should have enough wood to be able to get through. Now, we've only just started this playthrough. So, as you can see, we're only on Wednesday, the 3rd. We do need to find... Who was it? Jacob, I think it was. Oh. I could really use a delicious potato. Well, well we've got that coming, so... The is that the potato? Where did that go? I don't... Uh, okay. Um, but yeah, potato, we can... Was that... I don't even remember the name, Pierre. Well, that's going to be hard. I can't... I'm not very good at names. Um, well, remembering names, not na saying names, but... Right, here we go. You don't need to see this, because um, it's just Tim giving us a bamboo pole, and you saw this in the other time. So, now we're here... We have the bamboo pole, but that's not what we came for. We came for these sort of things. Clams are great. Um, what's this? A mussel? An oyster. Um, we're just going to take these. And here is what we actually wanted. So, let's just go here. Hmm. Oh. Well, that's great, isn't it? Well, I guess we will rush back and I will see you when I am back at the base. In all honesty, I am probably just going to speed this up until we've got 300 wood, so I'll see you then. Right, we have 302 wood. Um, I'm just going to put these things in my chest because we don't need everything, especially not um, pickaxe yet because that's ages away. Put that, oh, no, I'll just grab that now. Oh, I uh, don't really need that yet. So we're just going to run over to the fishing area now again, and I will see you when I'm there. Right, we made it. We're back at the fishing place a day later. But, here we go. This may be really worth it. Drum roll, please. That's one. Ooh, that's two. That's three. 
that's three. Wow. Well, we came all the way here for three. Ones, they're, they're not too bad, though, because it's still money from nothing. Um, anything else around this day? I guess we'll see how much we properly get at the end of the day. But, oh, you can go in here. Oh, it's not open yet. Well, that was good timing. Oh, okay. Thank you. Right, so we're just going to sell these here. So we now have 460 quid. So we could do a bit of fishing, but I am meant to be taking the farming thing as I am called Farm I Am, or no, well, um, the farm's called Farm Alarma and I'm called SMC Farmer. So I suppose if we can see it on the ground, we can scavenge it, we can do it, but I guess we're so dumb there we go, that's what the series is going to be about. We're not going to do anything to do with fishing unless we can find it on the ground. We will do, obviously we have to do some mining, but... Um, or do we have to do mining? Hang on, I'm going to find this out. Okay, so for this playthrough... Well, yeah, playthrough, we're going to call it a playthrough, not a let's play. Let's play trap. So... For this playthrough, we're going to start the timer, Sam, because this is going to go way over otherwise. Um, so, <laughs> um, for this playthrough, we're going to actually play it through normally. But, if you would like to see this coming soon, or in a future series, or a side series, if this because this is going to be once a week. Um, if you would like to see that in a split series, once I've completed for a long time the two series that are going... Um, then let me know in the comments now because I'd love to hear it and I'd love to hear what you would have got to say about it because that can't come, sounds like a nice idea doing the entire game without mining once I guess bombs will have to count because we will have to do slight mining but bombs are a lot more expensive and rare than actually going and grabbing the pickaxe we could be on a full-blown farmer that can't even do much or something someone sent me a challenge that I would be happy to do and I will do it. So that's it. There's your, That's a better comment. Give me a challenge to do in Stardew Valley. Right, on to the episode. We're probably running out of time, um, really. Oh no, well, it's not really gone up much. So we have got a bit. So cauliflower, tulips are absolutely terrible, apparently. Jazz seeds, sugar, sugar. Oh, this is food. Okay. Um, right. I guess we will get more... We need one parsnip because that's the quest. Um, I guess we'll get just a few more beans then maybe? Uh, let's go with more beans. Beans, beans, good for the heart. The more you eat, the more you fart, really, innit? So... Surely you lots of people want the beans. Right, I'll see you, when, see you when I'm back at the farm. Right, we're back at the farm, so we're going to plant some more beans. Water our potatoes, plant the parsnip, water this. Right, we're going to just put a few things down. Put this down, because we don't want it really near here. I've not got my pickaxe. Right, I think we're almost done for today. I guess we can just do a bit more of the farm. Till our energy 
two rooms though. I mean, we always need more wood, really, so we can just keep going with the wood. Leave one section of trees so we can get the seeds from it, so we can make the food as well. Or we could just plant them, I guess. Make a little bit of a farm there instead. Right, we're about to pass out, so let's go to bed. Like I said, if you've got any form of tips and tricks for me, just leave a comment. Just because it'd be nice to know that you're one, you're watching, and two, it'd be nice to also get some tips because I'm pretty newbie at this game anyway. Um, so any help from the players, because any player is pretty much more of a professional than me. But yeah, it would be nice to hear. Um, introductions. We've got to greet everybody, and we've got to harvest a parsnip. So these are still growing it's been it's quite nice that the weather is doing what it's doing but we're just going to keep farming away at these trees so i really now let's just talk about what i want for this channel then i'm um, off the top of my head because i haven't really written any notes so well I've, what all the notes that I've not written not written any notes but all the notes that i've gone through have gone through and we've got a few minutes um so I kind of hope that this will become like a little community, one for gaming and then for the people who are inspired by games like I was, because I was inspired by the little DS games and games on my Xbox 360 and Xbox One um, to play but while I was playing them to how they were built. Not really how they were built, but I did like the idea and where they came from. And then I found out when I got a little bit older that you could actually create them. As, and you can make art come to life like this. Like these are just little pixels moving. So that was sort of what got me into it. So I kind of want to make my own little community because one, it would be, uh, and it would be nice to be able to share games to people who already understand my type of development and my background and understand where I'm where I've come from. But it'd be also great to sort of help grow a community that can also inspire others as well so inspire others to create games and or even to start their own businesses can we no we can't kill that um inspire other businesses to other people to create businesses of their own or designs of their own or stretch out into photoshop or game design or any of the goals really i'm not trying to narrow people down paths or other things i'm just trying to get people motivated really in doing what they want to do because it's kind of difficult to figure out what you want to do. I was struggling about it for absolutely ages. So don't think that you have to make your decision now. But yeah, just if you if you've got this far, then why not drop another comment if you've commented already, or drop a comment again, a new comment or a fresh comment, your first comment, um, to tell me. A little bit about you. So, what what do you do? Um, what is it? What type of um, career do you want to get into? And and or if you're already in a career, or if you're in my career as well, the game career, game design type of career, or design career, what you've done for it, or what you're thinking of doing, or if you're a student, I'd love to know who who my actual fans I'm speaking to and who you are that I'm speaking to is watching right now. So that would be nice. But you don't don't feel like I'm uh, you need to comment but it would just be nice to hear who's watching and get a little bit to know about who you are cuz I'm hoping to eventually create things like discord channels and um, facebook channels that I can reply on cuz I am working on my own merch albeit slower because there's a lot of things to do with a youtube channel a business channel a second youtube channel which does tutorials and other sorts but I'll get there in the end, especially if I can put some money back into it to get some editors, because that'll make the a little bit of the side chain a lot easier on my say, side, because I have to I have to record, plan, edit, um, finalize descriptions, timestamps. If I actually manage to get around to that, on top of 
out next year, well not next year, in literally next month um, from when this is recorded as I'm going to be in uni. So I'm trying to get as many of these done as possible for you guys and girls and everybody so that I can actually have something to watch while I get absolutely swamped with work like usual in uni. Because if you've seen any of the blogs that I've done, it seems that when you get thrown with a group, then again it is last year. Sorry, I'm just rambling on. I guess that's kind of what this channel is about: a bit of talking, a bit of gaming, um, a bit of other people's experiences that I'd love to leave and um, read in the comments. But obviously, I can't stop to hear your experiences while I'm talking, because right now I'm currently talking to myself like a little insane person. But oh well, um, dear farmer, MC far, SMC farmer man. I'd like to apologize for joking about your grandpa's crossage when we first met. It's a little nice house. However, you need to leave blah blah. Nobody cares. Okay, so I'm going to pause my timer before it goes on. Blah, 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 blah. But that's it for the episode. In fact, we're going to move. Can we move the bed? Oh, sugar. Um, let's press that down. Move the bed here. So we can sleep and go into bed. Um, it's raining sleep. again, so we can And then that men. is where we're going right. to call it for today's episode. I hope you've enjoyed. Go yeah, and peace yeah, out. So I'm different. Uh, nah, I don't fit their system. So with the math class, that, that's a fact. Never backtrack. ADD's my life hack. Addicted to spitting rap. Angels on my back. Triple one, triple one. Telling me to carry on. What's the male, the evil one? Without him, we'd be known.